We now pick up the second game of the year. That guy will sit down. Thank you, sir. A 24-yard return. This is Stillwell in the red and Spyro in the white and maroon pants. And let's see, where are we? This is number 40. Jody Hull carries for one yard. Third down and six now from the Bulldog 33-yard line. Dwayne Lewis picks up two. And punting situation now. Number 86, John Cox checks in the punt for Spyro. 14-yard punt, no return. Stillwell takes over at the Bulldog 49-yard line. Hand off to Lloyd Setzer. Gain of two. Second eight from the 47. Brian Muskrat. Ahead for nine. First down at the 38. Muskrat again. Three-yard gain from the 35. Lloyd Setzer rumbles for nine yards. First down at the 26. Setzer five yards. Second and five. Setzer one yard gain. Third down and four as the rain begins to fall now. It is raining here tonight at Bradley Field. No gain for Setzer. Fourth down from the 20. Jimmy Hawkins passes complete to Mark Wilson. Six yard gain. First down. Brent Gray, seven yard run down to the seven. Brent Gray, six yard run, first down and goal at the one yard line. And Brett Gray, still well in the end touchdown. Five minutes, 25 seconds to play in the first quarter. Hawkins' pass is incomplete. Still well leads Spiral. Six to nothing, as you can see the umbrellas and the rain on the glass here in the press box. Kickoff was taken by number 41, Dwayne Lewis, returned 21 yards. Number 40, Jody Hole, carried for one yard. The quarterback is J. Jack Franklin. No gain. Franklin, back to pass. That's Jack Garrett on the defense for the Indians. Breaking up the pass, incomplete. Third, fourth down, and Spyro will have to punt. 32-yard punt, returned by Jack Garrett. Eight yards. Still has it at the 43-yard line. Handoff to Brett Gray, gain of one. Second down and nine from the 44. Gray around the left side. Six yards from the 50. Third down and seven. No gain. Fourth down, and Stillwell will punt. A 30-yard punt. One minute, 14 seconds to play here in the... Uh, there's a clipping penalty on this play. One minute, 14 seconds to play in the first quarter. The rain now has stopped. Lewis on the carry. Gain of one from the 11-yard line. J.J. Franklin loses two yards, and that's the end of the first quarter. Very quickly played first quarter. Six to nothing, still well out in front. Jody Hole carries for two yards. And John Cox's punt is partially blocked. It is a 23 yard punt. Will not be returned. 11 minutes, 8 seconds to play. Stillwell has it at the spiral 34 yard line. Hand off to Brett Gray. Gain of six from the 28 yard line. Second down and four. Jimmy Hawkins back to pass, looking and finding Brian Muskrat. Down to the 9-yard line. That's a gain of 19 yards in the first down and goal to go for the Indians. Hand off to Brett Gray. Pick up of 3 to the 6. Gray loses 4 yards. Third down and goal from the 10. Hawkins back to pass and he is hit and sacked. A loss of 9, so fourth down and goal at the 19-yard line. Hawkins back to pass and he finds Brian Muskrat and a Stillwell Indian touchdown on fourth and goal from the 19 19 yard touchdown pass from Jimmy Hawkins to Brian Muskrat a high snap with the wet field conditions incomplete pass Stillwell leads 12 to nothing with 8 minutes 31 seconds to play in the first half 15 yard return on the kickoff Spiral will have it at their own 38 yard line New quarterback in for the Bulldogs is Rodney Fouts. Being chased and finding 
Camp Lewis wide open. Actually, that's 41. That's Dwayne Lewis wide open, 24 yards. There is a clipping penalty wipes out the touchdown, though. It's a 24-yard gain when all is said and done at the Stillwell 38-yard line. Now, hole carries for no gain from the 38, second and 10. James Phillips, one-yard gain from the 37. Founts being chased and incomplete as Victor Payton bats the pass down. We have a one-play gap in the film. There's a penalty against Spyro. And Spyro is back to pass, and it has just been intercepted by Jack Garrett at the 10-yard line. He returns at 24 yards to the 34-yard line. And here is a penalty against Stillwell for clipping. Pushes it back to the 20. Hand off to Brett Gray. Gain of two from the 22. Brian Muskrat for seven yards. Third down now. Jimmy Hawkins to Brian Muskrat. Tackled immediately. Gain of only six. Penalty against Stillwell here. And the punt is a 25-yard punt, three-yard return. Hole carries for one at the Indian 49-yard line, at the Spiro 49-yard line. Three-yard gain, and now Fouts back to pass, overthrows his intended receiver, and Spiro has to punt. Two minutes to play here in the first half. It looks like Victor Payton on the return. There was a penalty on the on the play. And a penalty on this play, minus five against Stewell for offsides. From their own five-yard line, handoff to Brett Gray for six yards. Second down and four from the 11, handoff to Gray, two yards. Third down and two, 42 seconds to play in the half. Draw play to Gray, gain of 12. First down for Stewell from their own 25-yard line. Give is to Brett Gray, gain of three, and that's the halftime. There's the 1984 Stillwell Indian High School Marching Band. The 84 Marching Band is under the direction of drum major Beth Smith. And let's listen in and see what they're playing for halftime entertainment tonight. <laughs> Okay, we begin the second half. Still a leading. Spyro 12 to nothing. Victor Payton returns a kick 22 yards to the 32 yard line. Hand off to Brett Gray. Pickup of three, second down and seven from the 35. Gray. Six yard gain. Third down and one from the 41. Brett Gray again. Two yard gain. Raining very hard now. Just pouring down rain. First down. And 10 from the 20 from the 43 yard line. Give us the 21. Brett Gray on that last play. And on that play, it was Brett Gray for four. And now on this play, <laughs> it is Brett Gray for minus one yards. Okay, third down and six. 
we have a completion. Hawkins to Mark Wilson for 22 yards from the 30. Brett Gray picked up six from the 24. This is Brian Muskrat. Gain of five down to the 19. First down and 10. Hand off to Muskrat. Second down and nine after he picks up one. Brett Gray gets down inside the five yard line, but a 10 yard holding penalty against Stillwell pushes it back to the 28 yard line. Hawkins' pass is incomplete. Third down and 10, Hawkins. Incomplete, intended for Chad Catron. Fourth down. From the 28, Hawkins completes it to Chad Catron. Gain of only eight, though. Not enough for the first down. Spiral takes over on downs. Handoff is to Dwayne Lewis. Gain of one. Second down and nine from the 21. Quarterback is J.J. Franklin. Passing complete to Bronco King. Gain of five. From the 26, pass is intercepted by number 88, Kevin Benham, he returns it to the five-yard line. That was a 30-yard interception return by Benham. Handoff to Brett Gray from the two-yard line. Loses a yard at the three now. Gray fights his way down to the one. Doesn't quite get in. Third and goal from the one-yard line. And Brett Gray, Stillwell, Indian touchdown. A bad snap and the run fails, so with 3 minutes, 27 seconds to play in the third quarter, it's the Stillwell Indians 18 and the Spyro Bullfrogs, uh, Bulldogs, nothing. Kickoff is taken by Shea Bridges, 18-yard return out to the 33 of Spyro. Handoff to Dwayne Lewis, 6-yard gain. Second down and 4 from the 39, J.J. Franklin. Incomplete. Franklin now playing minor league baseball. Not sure which team he is affiliated with. Third down and four now. That was a handoff to Jody Hole. Gain of three. The punt. 36 yard punt. No return. Ball down at the Stillwell 28 yard line. Indians up 18 to nothing. Handoff to Brett Gray. No gain. Second down and 10 from the 28. Gray picks up four. Third down and six from the 32. Gray, no gain. Indians are forced to punt. Jack Garrett's punt travels 38 yards and is downed. The rain has stopped now. That's the end of the third quarter with the score. Still well 18, Spyro nothing. Hand off to Lewis. Gain of four, second down and six. Lewis, no gain this time. Third down and six. And another gap in the film. Looks like we had two plays missing that time. A penalty for against Stillwell and a punt, or a um, one-yard loss and then a punt. 31-yard punt. Ball at the Indian 31-yard line. One-yard loss by Brett Gray. Second and 11. Brett Gray picks up six. Third down, penalty against Stillwell for offsides. Hand off to Gray, loses a yard from the 30. Jack Garrett to punt. 26-yard punt, fielded by 24. The junior, Shea Bridges, two-yard return. At the Spyro 46-yard line. 8-yard carry by Hull into Indian Territory at the Stillwell 46-yard line. He is tackled in the backfield by number 37, Brian Muskrat. Loss of 4 and now an incompletion. 4th down, and the Bulldogs will have to punt. This is a 26-yard punt, 5 minutes, 41 seconds to play in the ball game. Stillwell up 18 to nothing. Handoff to Brett Gray. Gain of 4 yards, 2nd down, 6 from the Stillwell 28. Brian Muskrat. Lumbers ahead for six yards. A first down at the 34. Muskrat picks up three, second down and seven. From the 37, 15 yard penalty called against the Indians on this play. Pushes it back to the 32 yard line, offsides against Spyro. 
Now the ball is at the 27. Hawkins' pass is incomplete. Third down. Hawkins back to pass. Incomplete intended for Jerry Bruder, number 34. Punt goes off the side of Jack Garrett's foot. 17-yard punt, no return. Spiro takes over at the still 44-yard line. Three minutes to play in the ballgame. Seven-yard gain. Second down and three. Hand off to Lewis. Dwayne Lewis. Gain of two. Third down and one. From the 35, Jody Hull picks up five yards. First down. At the Stillwell, 30-yard line. Jody Hull picks up two. Second down and eight. From the 28, Hull. Two yards. Third down and six. Dwayne Lewis loses a yard. 36 seconds to play in the ball game. Still a leading 18 to nothing. Fourth down. Hand off to Jody Hull. And no gain. Indians take over. Don't have to run a play. They win it. That's a winner. Final score. Still Indians 18 and the Spyro Bulldogs nothing.